Hey, what is up guys? It's Rodia or Taylor here, and we're back with the News Division episode 11. Before we start, I just want to say a massive thank you for all the support on the weekly recap that came out on Sunday afternoon. I'm glad you really enjoyed it, and it's good to know that you are enjoying these episodes as well, and we'll be back with a weekly recap next Sunday. But it is now only a week until the Division launches, so let's get straight into the news. Sticking on the note of the Division launching, it seems that Amazon will now be shipping physical copies from March the 4th, so you should get your copy on or just before the 8th of March. March. Now with my past experiences from Amazon when I have pre-ordered a game they do tend to come that day early or so but at least you can guarantee you'll get it on the 8th. On Monday Ubisoft YouTube channel actually released an Nvidia Gameworks trailer. Now this is absolutely beautiful as you can see. The full link to the trailer is in the description, make sure you check it out and it's glorious 1080p in 60 frames per second quality. It looks absolutely beautiful, you can really see all the little details in this trailer. You can also tell how much work they've put into the PC version to make it as best and as immersive as they can to the real life New York City. A couple of days ago IGN asked you to post questions that they would ask the Division devs. Now this was an ask me anything type thread, but it was a bit of a letdown when they finally answered questions as most of them we already had answers to and they only answered questions that were very easy and wouldn't reveal too much about the game. Which is a bit of a shame as it's only a week away now you would have liked to know a little bit more about the game as in what end game content are we expecting apart from just a different difficulty for different missions but who knows we might get some more information soon but then again if we don't it's only a week away and we can explore it all for ourselves talking about features and games that we don't know yet the reddit user christian ryson who i have featured before in these news division episodes has actually come up with some more interesting information that has come from the game files now this regards a sort of team based game mode it sounds like now we don't know if this is against NPCs or PvP within the Dark Zone, but the way it suggests it is, that's a quote here, it says, the enemy has the upper hand, you only have 30 seconds left, and there's other little things like that. So it does make you wonder whether this could be something that was cut from the game, there could be a sort of team deathmatch game mode within the Dark Zone that we don't know about. It could even just be DLC that we haven't heard about, but to say the least, it certainly is interesting. Now it's time for the community news division. Got a couple of stories here, so let's make it quick and snappy before you all get bored. First one comes from the Reddit user SkillUp, who I have recently featured in this segment. He's reworked the DPS formula that is included in the division. Now this is a really in-depth look into it, it's got a lot of equations going on, and he seems to have really polished it up this time. He's got a couple of videos there to explain all about it, he's got a short version and a long version to cater your needs of how much time you want to spend learning about it. But I highly recommend checking this out, it is interesting, and it could help you play the game better. But massive shout out to him for putting his time and effort into this, highly recommend you go and check out his channel as well as a reddit post that explains everything. We've now got some custom made wallpapers again for your computer. If you got bored of the last wallpapers that I featured in the news division a couple of episodes ago, a reddit user xlowini who's released some more now, some really interesting ones that is. Some very clean wallpapers and some very high res wallpapers. Make sure you check these out, his link will be in the description along with all of the pictures and wallpapers that you can ask for. Now I can't help but feature this member of the community. I know Adolan Fox has come up with another great great cosplay of a division agent. He's really polished it up and made this one look as best as he can and it does look almost perfect and identical to some of the agents you can make or come across within the division. So massive props out to you again for coming up with this. The last member to make the cut for the community news division is a reddit user called Wheels with a one He's come up with another version of the division map. He's actually used a 3D Google Maps but placed the division on top and he's added screenshots from the game within the map so you're sort of walking around New York but within the division. It's kind of hard to explain, I suggest you check it out for yourself to know and understand a bit more to what I'm trying to explain. Anyway guys, that's going to be it. I really hope you enjoyed and if you did, make sure to hit that like button and if you're new around here, make sure to subscribe for all the future content because now we're only one week away and I've got some exciting stuff coming up. But until then, I'll see you all soon and thanks for watching.